This is Rags to Riches, a 14 season career mode where we start with the worst car in F1 2010 and try to work our way up the order to a top team in F1 23. The rules are simple. Beat my teammate and I can stay at this team for the next season. Lose to them and I have to go down the order. But to move up, I must get a top 10 in the championship. So let's begin. Here we go. The first race of the season in Australia. The lights are coming on. The engine is revving and we are racing in Australia. Straight away, going to put it up into Rich Mix and see what we can do for the Australian Grand Prix. And it's not as good of a start as we usually do on F1 2011. Kind of getting boxed in a little bit. Somebody's crashed into the back of me. Now we're going to try and have a look and see if we can lunge it on the inside of anybody into turn three. Oh my God. There is confetti everywhere. We've taken out Sergio Perez, I think that is. And I've got a penalty. That's his fault. We're going to just back out of that one. Oh, okay. And we've hit the Toro Rosso anyway. Rosberg has lost their front wing. Perez, I think, has probably got damage as well. We're going to go round the outside of all these guys. So I don't know what's happened. Maybe more damage further up. I think that's a Ferrari. He's got caught, caught up. We've gone round the outside of Sergio Perez there. Oh, my God. What a 360 for Fortrest. <laughs> We're going to go up the inside of Pastor Maldonado, try and get the car slowed down, which we do. So here comes Pastor Maldonado on the left-hand side, flying past me. Nothing I could do there. I'm going to box this lap, go for a fresh set of tyres, and then therefore avoid everybody in the pit stop. Into the box we go. It is going to be a 3.8 pit stop. Much better improvement from last year. Can we close in on straight line speed on Pedro De La Rosa? Lunging it on the brakes. Round the outside, beautiful. Where is everybody else? Got drivers coming out of the pit lane now. That is Ricardo. Schumacher has jumped us by an absolute mile. Can we do anything on Schumacher here? Hard on the brakes, right around the outside. And have we got him? Yes, we have. There we go. There is a driver going slowly. It is a Sauber of Kamui Kobayashi. We are back in the points, baby. Oh my God, here comes Michael Schumacher. We're going to go defend to the inside line. There is nothing I can do. I've lost the point. We're back in the points. What? we got to defend this. we got to defend this from Ricardo. No. No, you do not, Ricardo. No, you do not. I need to defend this position. I don't know what has happened, but somehow I am back into the points. Will it be points on debut or will Ricardo get us? It is points on debut for Force India. Let's go. The lights are coming on now. The engine is revving and we... Ah, oh, racing at the Sepang circuit for the Malaysian Grand Prix. Going to put it straight up into Rich Mix. Burn all of the curves and see what we can do down into the first corner. jean Eric Verne on our inside, breaking at the 100-meter board. Trying to go around the outside of everybody if it can work. Find a little gap between Hamilton and Rosberg. And that's worked as well. Oh, maybe a gap here as well. What a start. What a start from us. We're up into P7. We've got cars around us. But what a start from the Force India driver as we move ourselves up into P7 in this race. And maybe even more. Sergio Perez is up in the field. This really is like real real life. Sebastian Vettel, what are you doing? Get out of the way. He was twerking in front of me. Give me a little wiggle. Guys, we are onto the podium. Never mind, it's gone. Okay, Sebastian Vettel's overtaken me. What on earth is going on? Everybody's coming in the pit lane. What is going on? Every single driver has just come into the pits. Is it raining? Is there rain? Have I missed rain on track? What is going on? Right, into the box we go. Fernando Alonso takes the lead of this race. And it's a 3.8 second stop. Jensen Button will go through. And that's fine. That's okay, to be fair. We're going to have a nice big gap. Now, I think Fernando Alonso is going to come out ahead of me, but we might still stay ahead of Sergio Perez. Raikkonen gets us for now, but I'm pretty we sure they have to box again. I'm not going to fight him. I'm not going to fight him. Luckily, the AI are a bit silly. I can take a normal line through there. There goes Raikkonen once again. We're going to let him through. We're going to let him have that. And once again, we're just going to go up the inside. He's going to let me have it. We go around the outside here and go on the throttle, get on the curves. The AI have not boxed. So the only way now we can get back past them is if they get a puncture of some sort for going this whole race pretty much on prime tyres. Sergio Perez takes home a podium. Jensen Button will finish it off in third, but we're going to be fourth in Malaysia. What a race.
Yes! Let's go. P4. Curse and DRS down to the line. What is it going to be good enough for? It is... It's pole! <laughs> yes! Let's go. Pole position. But let's see if we can hold on to the lead of this race. Or is the AI going to be all too powerful? The lights are on. The engine's revving. We're racing in Shanghai for the Chinese Grand Prix. Going to use our curse. Put it up into Rich Mix Fuel. Mark Webber on the inside is going to hold the position. We're going to go the long way around the outside. The Red Bull driver. We're still wheel to wheel through the first corner. And it looks like Mark Webber might hold it, but we get the inside line through turn two. And I think we're going to hold it here, and we do. We hold on to the lead of this Chinese Grand Prix. Right, Hamilton on the inside. We're going to give him the room on the inside of the corner. Oh, what a send from Lewis. What a send. I probably should have put it into Richmond. Oh, it's Button. Where's he going? We're going to switch it back on him. Look at the straight line speed he's going to get and get him back down into the first corner. Here we go on Jensen Button. Down into the first corner. Whoa, Jensen. Just turned across me. Ben will get a penalty for that one too. Whoa, Jensen Button's so, so quick now. All of a sudden. What's happened? Come back here, Jensen. Come back here. But he's gone very, very deep. Trying to cut me up. We can go on the inside now. And we've got him back. Let's go. Let's go. Really only got Button and Alonso fighting us. Oh, that's not good. That's just a loud Jensen Button through. Look at this. Look at the straight line speed. We're going to have over Jensen Button. We can maybe lunge it on the inside. Breaking so deep and late into the hairpin. It's too deep. Jensen Button with the switchback. Beautiful maneuver. Right, into the box. Come on, where's this going to put me? Where are they going to be? It's a 3.8 second stop again. Where are the AI? Where are they? Where's Jensen? We're going to be ahead. We're going to be back in the lead of the Chinese Grand Prix. Let's go. Right, here comes Fernando Alonso. We need to go into standard mix. He is going to get the DRS on us. We're going to go to the inside. And we basically just open the door for him. We're going to break later than him, though, into the hairpin. Can we get the car slowed down? Yes, we can. And we've held position. One more corner left to go of the Chinese Grand Prix. They threw everything at me. They even got butted ahead. Oh, no. We've slid. No. No. We've lost it at the line. Did we hold it? Oh, my God. Did we hold it? No. No. We bottled that. The lights are on. The engine's revving. And we are racing at the Bahrain Grand Prix. And he, we're going to overtake people down to the first corner. Use a lot of curves and see what we can do into the first corner. Try and find our way amongst the other drivers. A big send. Pick out the gaps. See if anybody dri any driver's going to lose their front wing. Everybody gets through nice and cleanly. A little bit of pushing. A little bit of barging. Oh, Perez, get out of the way. And we're going to see what we can do. Maybe go around the outside of Lewis Hamilton. Sergio Perez has a little look. And we've got Sergio Perez. We're going to get back on Lewis Hamilton there. And move ourselves up to P7. What a start. Nico Rosberg. Maybe I can have a look at him. Under braking. We can. Michael Schumacher as well. Roman Grosjean holds on to P4. Somebody's driven into the back of somebody. And they've broken their front wing. We don't really mind though. We're up to P5. What a start. Right. Nobody's... Oh my God. What has happened? Both Ferraris have driven off the track. Okay. That's good. We're going to jump Sebastian Vettel. And move ourselves up into P2. We might gain here because I feel like we can drive quicker into the pit lane. Quick pit stop here, guys. Come on, into the box. Quick pit stop. 3.7. Where is Alonso? Massa, Hamilton. Oh, it's going to be close. It's going to be close. Fernando gets me. Fernando gets back into P3. I've got a plan. It might work. It might not. This is a terrible plan, or it could be an amazing plan. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Is it a good plan? It's a terrible plan. Even with DRS, I've got nothing. Right, it didn't work last time. We're going to try again. This time we have Kurs. This time we have Kurs. And we also have... Wait for it. DRS. <laughs> How is he still quicker than me? All right, let's get it all slowed down. And we've got Michael Schumacher. Let's go. There we go. That's what we like. And then we're going to switch it back on him. Yeah, he won't make a mistake, but we have DRS. We'll get DRS. And we get him back. Look at that. Right. Now we can't afford to do that again. Through the final corner, Michael Schumacher will have nothing left to try and attack us with. And it is P5 on track right there. There we go. Good points. Good amount of points to add to our tally. And that's going to help us hunt down for that P3. What are you doing in 17th? And Kimi Raikkonen, both having a shocker of qualifying. But nevertheless, the lights are on. The engine's revving. And we 
are racing at the Circuit of Barcelona, Catalonia for the Spanish Grand Prix. Away we go, using all of the curves and pumping it straight up into rich mix. Do we go inside or outside? We're going to go inside line here for this corner. Very, very close with Daniel Ricciardo there. We get the inside into turn one. We go run the long way round. Oh, I follow Perez and we've taken him out. Don't give me a pen. No, that was his fault. We're going to use the flashback. I'm going to come off the throttle. I'm not going to drive into Perez. Oh my God, that was so close. Okay, we're still going. Oh, we can have a little look at the inside of both these drivers. Oh God, what's happened now? Don't, why do I get the penalties? That were not my fault. I swear, stewards. Well, I don't get a penalty for that. Don't you dare. I know we tapped Schumacher on the rear. He's on my inside. We're going to hold it. We've got it. What a move. Batting there with Jensen Button. Oh, cheers, Paul. He's just going to let me pass, isn't he? Hey, thanks, buddy. He knows Michael Schumacher into the box, as are a few others. Box, 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 box. Oh my god, my comments are. <laughs> Unlucky Paul de Resta. Right, okay, we're going to hold on to position then from Paul de Resta. And nobody else is going to get. No, nobody else is going to jump me. No! Why are you holding me up for? But I think we're still going to be ahead. Oh, it's going to be close. We've done it. It's worked an absolute treat. The overcut is go. No, 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 no. What the hell? Why is it launched me back out like that? No! Michael, no! 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 How? How? Can we get a... Why are we getting a penalty? For what? Maybe we can get a safety car here. Oh, okay. Never mind. We got this qualified. Oh, well. That's us out. <laughs> We're going to try our best to jump everybody and hold track position. The lights are coming on. The engines are revving. And we are racing in Monaco. Let's get underway. Mark Webber won't leave us a lot of space on the outside. We're going to try our luck anyway. It's Monaco. It's the place to gamble. And we're going to get right up behind Sebastian Vettel and blast past him using the ERS. And there we go. Moving up into the lead. Jensen Button also with an insane start. And then I'll, for some reason, get a pedal. I think we could use a flashback. No, it's going to happen anyway. No, don't hit me. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's happened, guys. It's happened. I'm trying to get round. I'm trying to get round. Let me round. Let me turn the car. No. Debris everywhere. Oh, my God. We might get a red flag, to be fair. No. We bottled it. There's yellow flags. There's drivers pitting. We're going to get a very messed up field. Safety car's been deployed. We have a chance. We have a chance. That's a terrible restart. Why? Why is it so bad? Michael Schumacher nearly had a chance to jump us. Let's push and let's try and get Grosjean in this race. Oh, we're going to tag him. No, we're not. We're going to tag him now. We're going to get past him. Can we do it? Side by side, into to back on Roman Grosjean. We're going to go wheel to wheel still. He holds it. Fair play to Roman. Bows up here. Get him at the back. Switch it back on him. There we go. There we go. Surely we've got it now. Wheel to wheel into the back. And we've got him. And we're going to run down to the line. It probably should have been a race win once again. But it is back on the podium in Monaco. Yes, that was a tough one. That was a really, really difficult race. I cannot lie. Right to the back of the field. And as per tradition, my chat has put me in cockpit cam for this race. The lights are on. The engine's revving. We are racing in Montreal for the Canadian Grand Prix. And we're going to fly past all of these back markers into the first corner. Heike Kovalainen diving up the inside of him. And then go through this left and maybe have a look on the outside of Bruno Senna. No, we can't do that. He's holding a nice line. It's Bruno. We're going to go through the middle of both of them. And that is lovely. Good start. Already up into a top position. Are the inside of Raikkonen maybe? If we can. Around the outside of Raikkonen maybe. If we can. Maldonado and Ricardo going side by side. We've tapped Maldonado in the rear. We should get away with that. No damage. Nice stuff indeed. Up the inside of him. And maybe even Paul de Resta as well. We've got off the track. We're going to let Paul de Resta keep that position. We're going to try and keep it from Maldonado, but so much understeer through the corner. Have a little look at the outside of the hairpin. Breaking just at the 100-meter board. Give Maldonado a bit of room on the inside. Get a traction off the corner. 
And there we go. Fantastic start from us. Paul DeResta going on the attack of Jean-Eric Verne again. We're going to have a little look around the outside if we can. Break later than Verne. And it's a move into the final chicane. Paul DeResta, we're going to have a look around the outside, which becomes the inside now. And we've got him. Oh, my God. Up the inside of Sergio. We'll switch it back on Sergio Perez. Up the inside of the chicane. No, he breaks later than me. But we can get him back on the run. There we go. The switchback of dreams on Sergio Perez. Oh, what's Rosberg doing? Round the outside of Nico. We've got him. Oh, oh! What the f was that? We've broken our wing. We've broken our wing. Here we go. Flying straight into the box. New front wing's got to go on the car. This is going to be about seven second stop, I reckon. Only a six. Do you know what? That's not too bad. A six second stop to get a new front wing. And we're at the back of the... We're at the back again. All right, come on, come on, come on. Big dive here on Carter Kayan. It's not worked. He switched it back on me, but we're going to get him back on the exit. He's going to go defensive. Is he? Yep, he is. We're going to go right around the outside of him. Okay, cool, cool, cool. That's good news. Let's get Vitaly Petrov around the outside. We're going to burn the Kurs to set up the move and get him. He's going to break early and we're going to get him there. There we go. They're all in the pits. But where is this going to bring us out? Because they're going to skip turn one, remember? It's going to put us ahead of our teammate, but he probably would have had a front wing change as well. Right, let's go for it now. Go for it now on Perez. Let's go. Overtake Sergio. Can we get Grosjean as well? Around the outside. Into the hairpin. We're going to go wheel to wheel with Roman. He's going to dart across us. And we're going to switch it back. Use all the curves. And there we go. Oh, DeResta, no! DeResta! What did he do? Just going to make it through the last chicane. We're going to tiptoe through here to make sure we've got another car in the barrier. It's not going to do anything, though. It is points again in Canada in the cockpit cam. Seventh place. Good amount of points. Down to the line. It's a 140.6. Can we beat it? Yes! Pole position! And uh, Paul DeResta a little bit further down the field, just outside the top 10. But let's see what we can do here. The lights are on, the engine's revving, and we're racing in Valencia for the European Grand Prix. Straight up into Rich Mix. But I don't think we're going to need to because we've regained our lead. So we're going to put it into standard for now and hold on to the position. No need to waste, waste the fuel. We're going to need that later. Lewis Hamilton on the right hand side. Gonna break later than him, go around the outside of him. We can't quite do it. He's got me on the inside. It's gotta be pinned. It's still wheel to wheel with a McLaren driver. I think we might get DRS. He's letting me have the position. And I think I might also get the DRS from him. Here he comes for the overtake. Nothing I can really do there. Apart from maybe try and lunge one around the outside of the corner. Which we're gonna try and do here on Lewis Hamilton. Very, very late on the brakes. Try not to do a Maldonado of 2012. We've got him. What a move on Lewis Hamilton. Hamilton had a look. Oh, they come together. Weber and Hamilton coming together in the last corner. Right, don't run wide. Let's get into the pit lane now. Nicely done. Okay, let's see what we can do. Come on, quick pit stop time now, team. Let's make it a four-second stop. No hold up. 3.8! <laughs> let's go. We're going to be in the lead of this race by a long way as well. Here comes Mark Weber. Nothing I can do. Look at the pace he's got. Nothing I can do, but I'm going to break so much later than him. So much later than him. Can I keep it on the track, though? We're on the marbles. We can't. Mark Webber holds it. Mark Webber wins the Valencia Grand Prix. Buttons wide. Kobayashi can't get a run. It's P2. It's a solid result, but it should have been so much more. It should have been the win. Right, here we go. We are P18 on the grid for my home Grand Prix. Once again, having an absolute stink. The lights are on, the engine's revving, and we are racing at Silverstone for the British Grand Prix. Will it be another stinker for us? Only time will tell. Heading down to the first corner. We're going to try and pick off some drivers if we can. We've got in between Rosberg and Ricardo. The two R's. We're going to go to the inside now for this next corner. Dive late. Oh, my God. So late on the brakes. And we've absolutely smashed it. We're into the points. We go right around the outside if we can through this corner. Vettel's out wide. We've kind of given them a little bit of a tag. We've gone right around everybody. Oh my god, what a move! With it to B5. So much understeer. What the hell? Sergio Perez gets us back. Can we break later than him though? We're gonna try it. We're gonna try it. Pinter in him on the inside. He's still there. We did it. We did it. We got that position back. That's what we needed to do into the box flying in 
There, a little bit behind me. Got a little bit of a gap there. Right, driver's in the box. Salba is actually past us. So please don't hold me up, Sergio Perez. It's not going to be a hold up. It's going to be a free point. No! Did we get jumped? We didn't get jumped. Okay, yes, Raikkonen's in the box. There we go. Raikkonen is in the box, as we predicted. Kobayashi's dropped down a third. No! We're in a fourth. Wait a minute. What has happened? Never mind. Kobayashi was always third. Fernando Alonso is DNF through the last couple of corners. We've never scored points before at our home Grand Prix, but it is a fourth place at Britain. Yes! Let's go. What a result. What a drive. The lights are on. The engine's revving. We are racing at Hockenheim for the German Grand Prix, and it's off to a mega start. We're on the outside. We've got all these drivers to the outside of us. Pass them out on another. Close the door. We get onto the gravel momentarily. And now we're going to shoot up the inside line on Felipe Massa, Michael Schumacher, and even maybe my teammate Paul De Resta. On the inside of these guys, we spot a gap on the inside. It's closed off by the Sauber driver. We get a nice run through the straight. It's up to P5, P6. What a start to this race it has been. Into the hairpin now. Down here. Can we do anything on Lewis Hamilton? We're going to go deep on the inside. Rosberg, straighten up. You're fine. You're fine, mate. You're fine. You're fine. No penalty. No penalty. We got away with it. Yes. Vettel, straight line speed. There's not much I can do about that. I can maybe try and lunge it later around the outside. Or on the inside. Switch on Sebastian Vettel. What a lunge. We've got him back. And Rosberg comes through as well. Let's go. Okay. Oh, my God. Nico Rosberg overtaking me right now. Nico, no. Here comes Sebastian Vettel as well. What can we do? Can we go late enough on the brakes? Let's not spin around Nico Rosberg. Oh, it's so late on the brakes. Right, here we go. Box this lap. We've got a little bit of a gap to the cars behind us. Fly into the pit lane. Watch out for the gravel that's on the left. I still touched it. Wait, when did we break our front wing? No. No. That's lost us so much positions. I don't even know when we broke our front wing. To be fair, we've only dropped to P5. And as we've seen, the overcut works. Where are they going to rejoin? It's Maldonado. Oh, Maldonado. What could have been, Maldonado? We're going to try and hold the middle ground. If we can. We can't. He's going to fly past us. Look at that. But we can go later on the brakes than Sebastian Vettel. Can we? On the inside? No, it wasn't. No, it wasn't. That was a great move. There's no point. Michael Schumacher is so, so quick. But can we break later than the Mercedes driver? Up the inside, on the corner. We can, there we go. And Vettel will follow me through. It was P4 in Britain. And it looks like it's going to be back-to-back -back fourth positions in the career mode. Round the final corner for the last time in Germany till 2014. It's P4 on the grid. And that's a very solid result to keep us in the championship hum. At the midway stage of the season, we are in P4 in the driver's championship. We need P3 for a Lotus seat. And that is currently, if I can do the maths correctly, uh, eight points away at the moment.